look at it, it's, it's also insulating. It acts as an insulator over your plant roots. So it's insulating those plant roots from the hard freezes coming and it'll keep moisture inside. There's a lot of reasons to use leaves and keep leaves in your garden. As hey everybody, Sean and Allison here from Spoken Garden. Hi you guys, happy Sunday. Hope you're having a great weekend out there. So guys, today we're talking about the benefits of leaving leaves in your garden. Yeah, we have five great reasons to share with you, especially going into fall season. But before we get to all that, go ahead and click that subscribe button down below so you don't miss out on all our daily videos. So guys, fall season, lots of leaves are dropping, probably in your yard too, just like ours. And so we're gonna tell you what all the benefits are of just leaving them in your garden and actually putting them down and using them as mulch and for other reasons. Okay, you guys, so if you look at, this is one of um, our largest beds in our front yard and it's, a, it's always under construction for us. <laughs> but what we have here is this beautiful old dogwood tree. Yeah, this is the dogwood tree we're always showing you and talking about, and it's got a huge oh. canopy. This tree's probably just about as old as Allison. And oh, I. it's just a beautiful tree. My Maybe grandparents, it was planted when they bought the house, so it's, there's a lot of memories with this tree. And also we have a golden chain tree over there. We've got a small cherry tree, and then we've got a really large paper bark birch My too. My favorite so, tree. So all these trees are contributing their leaves down into our garden. Yeah, these are all deciduous trees, which means they're going to lose their leaves in the fall and winter. So what do you do with all the leaves? Since we changed our yard and um, certified it as a wildlife habitat about four or five years ago, we are always looking for ways to enhance and improve on what we're already doing around our yard. So because of that reason, one of our top reasons why you should just leave the fall leaves alone, they create wildlife habitat. Yep, bugs and different little critters like to snuggle down in there and nest and uh, get kind of cozy for the winter. And this is a great way for them to do that. This is a great benefit for them over the winter months. Like Sean said, I mean, critters, all kinds of beneficial insects over winter under the cover of leaves or brush or different um, branches and things that you would normally think to just get out of your garden beds. Yep. And one beneficial insect that I can think of right now is bumblebees. Bumblebees, They, they like to get down in there and they just snuggle down in and over winter. Yeah, so Sean and I have chosen, and we have for years, just to leave this layer of leaves as it lies, if that makes sense. <laughs> so guys, another benefit of leaving the leaves where they lie in your garden beds is it creates, it's a mulch layer, right? It's actually being used as mulch. It's great for weed suppression. It does a whole bunch of other benefits to your garden, for your garden. And it also, look at it, it's, it's also insulating. It acts as an insulator over your plant roots. So it's insulating those plant roots from the hard freezes coming and it'll keep moisture inside. There's a lot of reasons to use leaves and keep leaves in your garden. So guys, a third benefit of leaving the leaves in your garden is they're adding nutrients. They're, they're letting the nutrients, they're breaking down and getting nutrients down into your soil so your plants can then take it up and use it. So isn't that great? I mean, you're basically recycling uh, the plant nutrients from the tree back down into the ground. It's great. Okay, you guys, we're over in a different area of our front yard and you can see more leaves on the ground in this mulch bed. And we, another reason that we like to leave the leaves as they are is because it's a zero waste practice. And we try to employ that around our yard as much as possible. And the fifth benefit we wanted to tell you about, leaves are readily available. If you think of this as a benefit, as, as long as you have deciduous trees on your property, Leaves are always going to fall. They're always going to be available. Yep. And even your neighbors might have some that they're trying to get rid of. And you can just take them off their hands so they don't have to be hauled away and you don't have to contribute to any carbon dioxide. So it's a win-win for everybody. It's, it definitely is. It's free mulch. It provides habitat. It's a zero waste practice. And it adds nutrients back into the soil. So it's just great to just keep them in the beds. So guys, as always, leave your comments and questions down below for us. We love hearing from you guys. Give us that thumbs up, let us know we're doing a good job, and subscribe to our channel so you get updates on our latest videos. Yeah, that's a wrap for today, everybody. We'll be back tomorrow with our next project, so come stop by and see what we're up to. See you tomorrow, everybody. Bye, everybody. Bye-bye.